So everybody, welcome back to another video. <laughs> In today's video, it's um update video slash I said train run. Or yeah, train run. <laughs> so What's new is, um, in the garbage train car, added new pieces into it, and also, um, now they have this long, long train. And also, what's new is, Got a new car there, and also a new dumpster next to it. Um, and also have um, I beams there on the flat car. And then also have like bridge girders on this flat car. And then over at this house here is a new 1970 Dodge. Uh, no, uh, 1970 Roadrunner. And I'm blocking Main Street. <laughs> And where I'm running this, I'm running at 45 mark there. <laughs> the end's over here, and the engines are just over there. Oh yeah, and also got the police car on the bridge. It used to be over here. And, oh yeah, and I also have 1009 and um, 403. So I stopped it there, so I can get a nice picture. So, oh yeah, I have the back open because I want to get another shot, so. So, the engines are over there, as you can see. I just like it back here because it just makes it look, just like changes the look of the layout. Like when we first started on that yard over there, where you can see the double stacks, and we just had the grass there, it kind of looked like an, like kind of looked like farmland. <laughs> and it kind of looked cool, but then we added a yard there, so. And then you got the two tracks back here going into the tunnel. Got power line on top, and they run down, and then over here, and then down to the power plant down there. And you have this old, um, like, coal or grain tower that's sitting here. And it kind of looks like you can have a track go down, the, like, through the middle of it, but I don't think... Or maybe, um, I don't know. And Swift there. And it kind of looks like... 
and you have the little yard limit sign there. Power line, and then you got the hay bales back here. And you got the junkyard. And that STP car there, I actually tore the doors off of it to, to make it look like it's wrecked and, and it belongs in there. Yeah, the cars. And you got a truck park there. And tow truck. And some cars there. Hey, you know, never really see this side <laughs> that much. And it goes up in the farm there. You got Conrail and an unmarked NS there. And the DPW. Oh, yeah, and then also in the park there, have two um, coal or charcoal. I think it's coal. Um, Check making the corner. They got all of that back there. Three. Yeah, I also have um one of the gates down. Um. And I'm back over here. And before I left to go in the back, I noticed the pig there in the corn. Right there. So, and you got another yard limit sign, 20 miles an hour sign. And then, I am the punk. There's the whole train. Oh yeah, and I was also gonna put that caboose at the end, um, but it didn't work because the two different coupler heights. So I just left it as a um, tanker car at the end there. Just came out of the tunnel now. And it's coming down the front stretch. There it goes.
coming slow. Stopped at another rectangle. Alright, so he now has a green light, but over there by where the tunnel exit is or entrance, he has another rectangle. <laughs> So he zoomed in over there so you can see when he comes out. There he goes, he's now stopped the signal over there. And he now have Bigfoot <laughs> parked at the garage and at the gas station. So I'm going to do one more run and then that's going to be it. So now he has a green signal. So, um, this, um, this, so for the video, it will be like a shot of it moving, and then now it's, um, like, you, everything stopped. Well, there was a long period of time in between that. <laughs> this boxcar kept derailing back there, and all I wanted to do was get a shot of it moving through here, like that. And it kept derailing, and um, I was just like, I'm just going to pull it to the front so I can re-rail it or take it off. And um, while I was pulling it in the middle of the tunnel, it tipped over, knocked, knocked this off of the flat car, and this was laying on its side. And I was like, Ugh. So I pulled the train out, flat car's still over there. Um, it's on it's like it's not fully on the track and um, I took the window out I looked and I saw it was on the corner in the middle of the tunnel so I was like Ugh. and then um, I took the Conrail engine there made its way into the tunnel and um, pushed the um, boxcar out 
end this, and then I went to the back and had this long um, tool and dragged it from there and grabbed it. And now I'm just going to park these on the side over there, over here. And that's where they're going to sit. Because <laughs> I ain't having a derailment. And then what happened here is um, when I was fixing the wheels, because I took, because we took the wheels off for um, those there, and um, I drilled the hole too big accidentally, and then um, I had this here, and what I do is um, just have it on the track, and then just has it. And then just have it sit on it. Oops, sorry. And have it sit on it. So when it derails, it's gonna stay right where it was. Like that. So, yeah. But I'm just gonna put it back on the track. So. So that's gonna do it for this video. Oh yeah, and also um, I actually have it correct this time with the sun visors. Um, cause usually I don't have them out, but today I do. <laughs> but anyway, that's all. Right. That's gonna do it for today's video. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.